It's real small with cars and crypto now. Back with another huge shout out to everybody tuning in this video. And if you aren't subscribed and you want to join the Double R family, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Today is day number one of the fix and flip. So the first thing we're going to do is take off this flooring. I know on the camera it doesn't look that bad. In some areas it isn't that bad, but like for instance here, missing a little piece here, and over here it's like all bundled up because some water got under here and we actually might have to put some new plywood under here now i know some people may think why don't you just try to find a flooring and try to redo it but i, I think that we just had need to put a new flooring in here because it might be too hard to find it so we're going to take out all this flooring and then we're going to see how well it is right here we might have to put some new plywood i'm not sure but enough with the talking it's time to get to work So, we got all the flooring up. As you guys can see, all the flooring, we got the trimmed out. But, this is, see, when, this, when you flip the house, this is what happened. This is Zay for all y'all. I'm sure y'all know who this is. This is Zay. This is my guy Zay. So, when you're trying to do this work on these houses, you have to go behind stuff because sometimes you never know what you're gonna get. We did know that the flooring was messed up over here where the refrigerator was. But after further in get investigation, it's way worse than we thought. So, I told you guys we're gonna have to get some plywood, which we're for sure gonna have to get plywood. We have to get plywood and put brand new plywood all right here. Um, and then, next, we're gonna take the cabinets out because we need to make sure that there's no mold or anything down there. So after we take that out, then tomorrow we're gonna put the plywood down. Then we're gonna put the new plywood in. Then we're, now we're gonna probably have to get new cabinets because these may be rotted out. We, we, knew, we knew about about them having a water problem. They did have a water leak. They already told us they had a water leak. But I didn't know it was going to be this bad. Um, so, this is what happens. You unpack it something, then you just you open a can of worms, and now you got to do this, now you got to do that. Now we might have to get new cabinets. And then that means that we, if we get new cabinets, we probably get new countertops. And then this is, all, this is how it all goes. Everybody think it's sweet. Everybody think you can just go boom, 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 boom. That ain't how it works. Stuff happens, then other stuff happening on top of that, on top of that, and then now we're here. But it's time to take off the cabinets now. So I'll see you guys when they're out. So, as you guys can see, we finally got all the cabinets out. Yeah, we're gonna have to buy some new cabinets. So tomorrow the plan is to get the plywood done, probably go to lumber liquidators or home decor and look at some flooring. Um that's probably it. You never know. I'm tired, so don't don't mind me. Oh yeah, we cleaned out all this stuff too. So all this stuff gone. We might have to get new countertop. I don't know yet. We're gonna try to finesse and use that, but it, it may not happen. We put everything in this garage because now we're gonna have to get a dumpster to put all this stuff in. We got all the flooring and cabinets in here. So. That's pretty much it today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, you guys need to comment below and let me know. I need you guys to comment below and let me know what colors we should go with, what we should do, what we should change. I mean, just, just make, tell me what you would do. Again, I'll see you guys on the next one. It's real Tyrone, and I'm gone.